The current D.W. Williams Hall was originally built as a gymnasium 78 years ago and was converted to the art building in 1972. Elena Mars, a senior museum conservation student at NMSU, says the art program has outgrown the current building. I think we absolutely need a new building. Um, you can see that what we're working with is very old, dilapidated. It wasn't intentioned for the purposes that it's being used for right now. Um, there's not a lot of uh, shaded space. There's not a lot of storage for the sculptures that we're creating. And it really hinders and limits what people are able to create. The building is also running out of storage space for the university's art collection. And 19th century paintings are being stored in rooms with falling ceiling tiles. Julia Borello, academic department head for the Department of Art at NMSU, says you can still see the gymnasium features in the building. A lot of the space is used up by the bleachers. It creates a lot of unusable workspace. Um, and then the building is just basically old. We have our main ventilation system is in this space here in the sculpture yard. And it, the, we do a lot of chemical processes in the building, and there's just not proper ventilation for a safe environment. The, you know, 20, 30 years ago, people weren't so concerned about fumes from art making materials, but we're very conscious about that, and we're really intent on having a safe working environment for students and we just don't have proper ventilation for that. Borello says there has been wide community support for the project. We were really lucky in that we've got tremendous community support and so they raised eight hundred thousand dollars over the last couple of years that were was used to fund the architectural um, initial schematic design and so we've actually got designs for the new building and because we're interested in a pretty interdisciplinary program what we've done is work with the architects to design a building that allows for a lot of overlap space sort of shared space where we'll have like a digital fabrication lab that can be used by students from any media area. Elena Mars says incoming students will benefit from the new collaborative spaces. Even though I won't be able to enjoy the new facilities, um, it's going to be important for future students because they're really going to be able to expand what they're able to do and work with and make um, by creating spaces where they're shared. Um, they'll be able to learn more from other artists and it's going to develop like a lot of cool, cool things, I think. The new building will be built in the parking lot of the current D.W. Williams Hall, and they will have to apply for more state funds to demolish the current building. For KRWG, I'm Samantha Sonner.